What's going on everybody? Welcome to the channel. Today's video is going to be a shorter video and a little something different. I'm going to show you today, per request of a viewer, how to record your gameplay using the Quest Oculus 2. There's two ways I know how to do so. First way being through the headset itself, and the second way being through the smart device and the app provided by Oculus using its casting feature. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing, hitting that bell notification, that way you know when any new videos come out. If you like the content of the video, give us a thumbs up. If you don't like the content of the video, leave us a comment below and we'll be sure to fix what we need to fix in order to make this video better for you. Without any further ado, let's get into it. Hey everybody, it's Ben with Oculus Prime. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to record footage from within your virtual world or uh, inside your headset once you already have it on. Uh, so once you're in your virtual environment that you have created for yourself, uh, the main screen as some people might call it, You've got this little bar down here and you got the pink arrow uh, so that says sharing so you're just going to click on that and then up here on the right hand side you've got recording uh, as you can see i'm already recording so i'm not going to stop it but when you click on that a whole new menu pops up and at the top right of the menu it asks if you want to record your voice with whatever you're going to be recording uh, so if you just want to record gameplay and you don't want your voice in it, then you can just hit start recording. But if you want your voice, make sure you go, uh, go ahead and hit that toggle switch first and then go ahead and start your recording. Uh, once you have something recorded, you can go into your apps and find files. And all of your recordings are going to be in the files. Uh, you can click on this headset, click on Oculus and video shots, and whatever you have recorded will show up there. Uh, I don't have anything previously recorded saved to my oculus right now but uh, whatever you record will be right there and then you can upload that to your pc or mac or whatever you're going to use uh, for that later uh, now let's say you want to record from within a video game uh, once you get into a game we'll just click on this one right now and let it start up so once you're inside the game you just click the oculus button on your right controller and it pulls up the the pause menu uh, over here on the left side, you can see I'm still recording, but uh, that obviously won't be lit up red. Uh, it should have some sort of other symbol other than a, a stop symbol. Uh, but you'll just click on that, and then the same menu will pop up asking you if you want to record voice or if you just want to go ahead and start your recording. So uh, set your uh, recording up the way you want to there, and then click Start Recording. And then from there, you can just click the Oculus button one more time to get out, and you'll be recording whatever you want to record. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and send it back over to uh, Jason and let him finish up the video for you guys. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks a lot, Ben. All right, now I'm going to show you the next portion of the video. The second way that you can record gameplay data using your Oculus Quest. So at the bottom of the screen here, you'll see I have my Oculus app. Go ahead and click on that. As soon as you're in there, this is your main screen. At the top right-hand corner, you'll have... Uh, goggles with what looks to be like a Wi-Fi symbol. Not everybody's app will look the same. I don't know what an Android app looks like. This is an iPhone, so this is what I'm going with. You're going to click on that, and it's going to bring you to this screen here. Right now, my Quest isn't turned on, and it's not going to pair with my phone. But if my Quest was turned on where it says not connected, it'll have my Wi-Fi connection there. And then underneath that where it says this phone, it'll say connected. As soon as that happens, the start button will light up blue. When the start button lights up blue, I'll click on that. and It'll take me into a live view of what the actual headset is seeing. So whoever's wearing it, whether it be you or a friend, it'll show exactly what they're seeing on the screen uh, real time. So as you're looking at that, there'll be an option on there to click. It's a camera that will start recording what you're seeing and it'll give you a running time of how long you've been recording. When you're done recording, you'll hit the same button again. It, it'll be red at that time. You'll hit it. It'll stop the recording, and then it will put your videos in this screen here. All recorded casts, whether it be um, from the Oculus headset that you record, like Ben showed you just previous to this, or what you're casting from your phone to your phone, from the oculus headset will all show up in here i believe the allotted time is 30 minutes for a recording and then you'll have to restart another one but it's really 
easy to use and it's a great way to share with your friends the kind of content you have or just to kind of look over it again and see if there's anything you could do differently. Well, hopefully you liked this video. Um, if you did, um, hopefully you'll give it a thumbs up. And um, if you didn't, hopefully you'll give us some positive uh, feedback or criticism that we could use to make our videos better in the future. Until next time, uh, have fun. Any questions, leave in the comments and I'll try to answer them. Thanks a lot, guys, for watching.